Hello everyone, welcome back my channel. Kelly Clarkson says it's not hard to be vulnerable, except when discussing one thing. Kelly Clarkson has never shied away from being her true self. In a new interview, the Grammy award-winning artist and talk show host open up about sharing her vulnerability with others and how she navigates boundaries when discussing her heartbreak. It's not hard for me to be vulnerable as a person, Clarkson, who finalized her divorce from ex-husband Brandon Blackstock in 2022, told E! News on Thursday, but when it involves other people's lives, that's when it's hard. You have to navigate that line of, wait, is that okay? Or, can I talk about my kid with this? Like in my heartbreak, there are certain things I'll talk about and certain things I won't, Clarkson added. It's not that I'm not comfortable talking about it. It's just I don't know if other people are involved. It's about how to toe that line. Clarkson and Blackstock shared daughter River Rose, 9, and son Remington Remy Alexander, 7. The former couple got married in October 2013, but in June 2020, the Since You've Been Gone hitmaker filed for divorce, citing irreconcilable differences. Since then, the two have engaged in both custody and business disputes. Clarkson was awarded primary physical custody of their two children, and the two share legal custody. A judge later ruled that Clarkson pay Blackstock almost $200,000 a month in both spousal and child support. The former couple battled for two years over ownership of the Montana ranch they once shared. In 2021, Clarkson lost a bid to evict Blackstock from the ranch after he refused to vacate the property. The dispute was settled in January 2022 when a judge ordered that Clarkson give Blackstock a 5.12% stake in the ranch, which equaled $908,800 of its total $17,750,000 value, according to People. Because her private legal battles and heartbreak were highly publicized, she feels she can connect with more people on a deeper level. I think I'm more normal than not, she told E. I think that's what people gravitate towards. I'm not that different from everybody that you might know. We're all similar, she added. We all have the parts where we love to showcase our talent, what we're great at, but we all have those parts where we love to listen and learn. We have those parts where we want to be a little more comedic and lighthearted. 